Welcome back, fellow fans of Clash of Clans. It is an exciting year, 2018, to be a Clash of Clans player, and this is why. Many have predicted the introduction of Town Hall 12, and we, of course, will see new units, maybe some new defenses, new walls with that. Maybe there will be a change to the wall system, and us, the Clash of Clans community, well, we can help out, you guys. We can help by providing content suggestions to the team. And that's what we are doing right now through ClashRoyaleCardMaker.com slash COCTC. And let me just clarify, I don't even really know the guys over there at that website. Nobody paid me for this. It is not sponsored. I don't get anything if you go to the website. I just thought it was cool. Uh, you've seen the card maker. Now you've got the troop maker. And these are the first finalists that will be going down to the $25 winners. So if you think you can outdo these ideas, then definitely let me know. Tweet me at Galadon Gaming with the hashtag MadeMyOwnTroop. All right, we're going to run through these real quick and take a look at some of what has come in so far on to my Twitter account. And I think you guys are going to say you could probably do better up until the end of the episode when we get to take a look at Vav Vavson's most recent idea. So again, you can create these troops yourself on that website, send them to me, and get yourself in the running for two $25 gift cards, or if you can't get the gift cards, I can send you cash on the PayPal barrel head. All right, first up, we've got, well, okay, so maybe not the most original idea, the Prince. Uh, we see it on Royale. Would it work in Clash of Clans? I don't know. I don't really think so, but... I'm going to let you guys decide from the original ones we've seen here, like the Mystic P.E.K.K.A. So take a look at the Mystic P.E.K.K.A. Again, I want you guys to judge based upon utility, based upon the looks, based upon creativity, and based upon, most importantly of all, the potential that this could actually end up in the game. So what do you think about the Alchemist card? You never know, cards like this, now that, I think I've seen him somewhere before. But I do like the title of the Alchemist and the utility as well, possibly a future addition. But remember, you guys, let's also think about functionality and originality. Okay, moving on. The Rocketeer. Now, we've heard some rumors in the past that there was a Rocketeer that was under development at one point. This, the Rocketeer idea, may be not the newest, but you guys can vote in the comments and in the description. I will put the link of a poll for all of these cards so we will get down to two finalists out of this group and maybe one will be the drop ship maybe not actually i would prefer to see troops that are not in royale right now just being moved over like how about the galadon uh don't vote on that one all right next up how about the ice hound there you go a slight variation of the lava hound you've got the ice hound that is going to be freezing enemies instead of lava pups of course it will spawn ice spirits Maybe not completely unique, but it is a new twist on an old troop. And here's another twist, the Lumberjack. He sounds familiar. He doesn't look like the Lumberjack from Royale. He's more of a wall buster. I don't know. Again, we're looking for original functionalities here. That may be a little bit too close to the Battle Ram or a Wall Breaker or even a Bomber. Next up, how about the Earth Wizard? Is it time for another wizard in the game? Do we need yet another wizard? This guy is slightly different. Again, I'm looking for originality. I'm hoping you guys will stretch the limits of your imagination. I know I've seen this in the past from the Clash Royale card maker. I'm sure that we can do that here with the troop maker from the same website. All right, next up we have, well, okay, so you've got a slightly different troop. You've got an air archer. It's not completely original, but here we go. Talk about completely original, the orc paladin loving this right here we even see original art for the orc paladin and hey you know you've got goblins why not orcs it's a very common character throughout many mobile games let's bring in some orcs the orc paladin may be my favorite so far i will probably go down and drop a vote on that one myself but here we go last but not least of course we've got the fellow youtuber Vav Vavson up and coming with some crazy ideas. Clash of Clans, the future, the Ranger. Now, this isn't just a regular Ranger. This is a Ranger that clones himself. So I I honestly feel like Vav missed a little inside joke here. Why not call him the Clone Ranger? I, 
get it, get it, and there could be a joke about Trigger in his description. Totally, I see it right now, the Clone Ranger, but no. He's gone with the Ranger. I love the art right here. If you guys want to check him out, Vav Vavson on YouTube, and you can see the video he made that goes into much more depth about this specific troop and how it would work in Clash of Clans. For now, I will throw it into the poll, but the top two are going to advance. So the top two that get the most votes will advance to the finals with the next episode going and looking for a possible new troop in Clash of Clans that you guys decide on. These winners will eventually be forwarded to Supercell in my future visit there, and we will definitely pressure them for some new troops to go along with that new town hall. What, 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 what new town hall? Town hall what? You, hey, come on, you guys. I've said it before. It's not if Town Hall 12 is coming. It's when Town Hall 12 is coming. That last big update with the new levels in Heroes did delay the update, I think, just because it gave more stuff for maxed out Town Hall 11s to progress through before they're maxed out once again. But once they get maxed out again, you gotta keep them growing. You have to keep the top end, the end game, the maxed out bases getting harder and harder to get to, give them more work, more farming or whatnot. And so yes, I do feel like 2018 is definitely the year for Town Hall 12. What will it look like? Will it be space age? Will it be retro? I don't know. I would love to see your concepts for Town Hall 12 as well. Who knows? Maybe it'll go in a completely different direction. You know that the Clash of Clans team is always surprising us with their ideas. Some people pleasantly surprised, and admittedly, some other people maybe not so pleasantly surprised. But hey, you can't please all of the people all of the time. We have such diverse communities within Clash of Clans. War, farming, trophy hunting, casual, hardcore, and everything in between. You can see the controversy of the clan games. Not everybody is happy with that either, even though there is a lot of free stuff coming. And maybe we will talk about that in a future episode. Also, suggest what you would like to see in other future episodes. Keep those tweets coming in at hashtag made my own troop. Let me know if you've got an amazing idea for a new troop, new card, or new town hall, or something completely different. Thank you guys, Galafam, for sticking around all the way to the end of the episode. Make sure you like, comment, and subscribe. Tell your friends, neighbors, parents, teachers, and gardeners. Have a fantastic rest of your day, and I hope to see you all back here again tomorrow for more full attacks. What do you know? You didn't know I was going to say that. What a shocker! Gally Dog, are you talking to yourself again? Come on, man. You need help.